The Fairmount Founders Award was established in 1988 for individuals who have contributed outstanding service and exceptional generosity to the university. Past recipients of this award, and I know many of them are here tonight, all have a common thread. They unconditionally share their time, their talent, and their resources to help our students and the greater WSU community thrive. Pam and Alex do that. My dad would drive us through campus and it was homecoming and we would see all the house displays from the sororities and fraternities and they um, had the floats parked out on their front yard. So that is what really um, is the first memory that I have of seeing Wichita State and um, I was a young child then and thought that was just really amazing. Greg Hand, who is the Dean of the College of Health Professions, and uh, he was talking to me about supporting his uh, advisory council. And um, so that's one way I stay involved. The other way would be athletics, particularly basketball. I'm a basketball fanatic. Well, I know the AMARs are you know, big fans of the student athlete here at Wichita State. They donate a lot of their resources to you know, help the product here at Wichita State, and that's the student. Athletes is one thing, but when you support you know, the mission and what Wichita State's about, that clearly gives an advantage to students here because they have the best resources in the country to obtain that goal, and that's to get a degree and to get hired post-college. You know, Wichita State is very fortunate to have people like the AMARS that will step up and help out whenever they're needed. Their loyalty is why they're involved at WSU. They're very involved and loyal to their friends, to their family, to Wichita State, and to uh, the community and business relationships they've developed over the years. They're very loyal people and they're just great people. Their commitment stands out in so many ways. Pam of course is chair of the advisory board for the College of Health Professions and Alex has spent many hours also working with that task force, that advisory board in providing his um, expertise. I really feel pretty strongly about um, supporting higher education in the city that you live in and if you support Wichita State you support Wichita. Since I went to WSU for undergrad and I have a fondness, you know, a soft place in my heart for it. It's near and dear and I'd like to see it continue to flourish. You can get um, whatever experience you'd like to have that you can still have the same feel of a small town university as well as a large town university that you have opportunities to be involved with Greek life on campus but you also have an opportunity to be involved with different programs where you can go out and actually see what's going on. If I could say one thing to the AMARs, it would simply be thank you. The two of them obviously come and support Shocker athletes at different events, but you see them all the time on Wichita State's campus, whether it's a different charity events, different boards. Uh, they're just tremendous people and they dedicate their time to those different things. Pam and Alex, you both are so loved by the greater Shocker community, and we are thrilled that you are this year's Fairmount Founders Award recipients. Congratulations and go Shocks.